Hey, it's your reigning supreme, the dog queen, and welcome back to my channel. Cause I'm the fucking supreme. So today, we are continuing our trip into the shadows. As uh, so we have Ash Silverstein, our third boy doll. Which is nice, because we need more boys. And I'm glad that Shadow High gave us a boy doll. Very first series, or first boy doll. Very nice. And we still have everyone's same description. Really cool. And then says Ash Silverstone and he oh and then he has an audio and visual effects focus which is nice a little movie editing stuff so that's really cool uh same stuff as usual so now let's unbox this bitch so here we have him out of the box it was a little bit of a of a struggle this time because I tried to save the um, plastic from the box for an art project. We'll see how well that goes. So if you want to see how to unbox them the easiest way that you can, check out my Heather review. And if you want to see uh, the changes that they made with the little clothing boxes on the side, check out my Nicole review. So he did come with a brush because he does have actual hair. That's one thing I do appreciate about Rainbow High is that all their boy dolls don't have sculpted hair. They all have real rooted hair, which is nice. Now, speaking about his hair, it is the same exact hairstyle as River, except he has a little bit of uh, shaved sides right here, which look cool, like they do, but I would have liked to have seen something different. Like, make it shorter, like, have him flip his hair up or something. Like, I myself am going to be washing his hair and trying to restyle it into a different way. So it just looks better than just, you know, blah on the back, you know? But it is a nice uh, blend of grays and a little bit of metallic silver in there because I think he is supposed to be the silver one. Uh... Yeah, and then if we move on to his ear accessories, inside of earrings, he comes with AirPods, which are so cool. They're really nice, and they do just go in just like earrings. So you can give him earrings if you'd like, or you can just stick with the AirPods, or you can give the AirPods to other characters, like Poppy, who should have gotten AirPods if he can get AirPods. Uh, so when we move on to his face, it is a different sculpt than the two other boys, which is nice, but he does have the same eyebrows as Finn, which I don't mind. Um, yeah, he just brand new eyes, a uh, new eye color too, has a little bit of teal and green in there. Really cool. And the, this eye shape just looks so much better than the original boy sculpt. It's not, the original boy sculpt isn't bad. I like him, but this one is so much better. Uh, and then he does have a little paint on his lips because, sorry, but dudes do have color in their lips no matter how many times dolls want you to forget that. They sure do. Um, his nose and mouth shape, I think are the same. Now we move on to his outfit. It is uh, very similar to Winter Break Jade's outfit with all the Japanese text, like this level 99. And then it has like cargo pockets, which are usable, they're functional. Same with his little pockets right here. He has grommets and drawstrings right here. Shadow, little silver equal signs. That's what I'm calling them. You can call them stripes. Uh, his jacket is a little bit lighter of a gray. Has shadow on there. Black right here. More Japanese text. Shadow high, stylish 2022. Anti-sparkle. So yeah, this is very much giving winter break jade. Alright, and then his... Uh, the back of it says shadow high. And then there's more text. Shadow high since 2022. Lots of writing on here. Yeah. 
Uh, it has like ribbing right here. It's a very nice jacket. And there's a little collar and it's actually a snap right here. So it stays shut. And just open it up like that. Which looks really nice. But my only issue is that the shirt ended up being longer than the jacket. So it doesn't look as good. I would have preferred for the jacket to be longer, but that's just a me thing. Uh, his shirt does say shadow in alternating colors and in a triangle because he believes in recycling. I wish that they just used snaps on the uh, little wraps in Pacific Coast BTW because the Velcro does not stay as well. And act, like they have access to snaps. Should have done it, but they didn't. Now his uh, socks are black and silver, and then it, they're like, these kind of remind me of like, I don't know, I've seen this before. Is it Adidas, Reebok? Some sports brand, but it just like, winter, not Winter Break Jade, Series 1 Jade, his shoes say Shadow. And then SH on the back. I don't know, these are pretty cool shoes though. Her. All right, so now we can get him into his second outfit. And before that, I can actually show you his body and articulation. So I'm saddened to report that it is the same old boy body that we've gotten. I have issues with it, mainly the fact that he's like, all the boys are like ripped like this with six packs and like, it's unrealistic. It really, really is unrealistic and it bothers me because as someone who it does not have a six pack and there's a lot of dudes who don't have six packs i don't know it's just pushing bad body standards yeah i said it and so far i've only seen the most realistic boy body on an lol omg so i know they can do it <laughs> so uh mine also has kind of loose legs so we got that going on uh he does have a chrome uh boxers on so interesting uh his articulation is exactly the same as finn's so he has the ball joint in the head um the ball joint in the shoulder the hinge and swivel at the elbow the ball joint at the hip, the uh, twist at the thigh, and then the, like, oh, actually, he, his knee goes farther than Finn and River, but still not as far as the girls. So, a little disappointing. What about the other knee? Yeah, it goes farther than River, but not as far as what the girls can do now. And he also does still have the ankle articulation, which is nice. There's a second outfit. I actually really like it. <laughs> it's, um, it's really cute. I like it more than the, his first ones. His first one just seems like boy version of, uh, jade's winter break outfit well this is definitely different and it lets us know more about his style which is more um athletic wear like just being comfy while river is more of american eagle and uh finn is more of uh just beach wear so it's nice that we're getting different styles with the boys i would say Rivers is still my favorite style out of the boy dolls. It's basic, but it's cute. <laughs> so, uh, starting off with this jacket, it is really nice. It's this light gray color with some, like, beige, uh, pleather looking white on it with some gray, like, pockets right here. Has eclipse and a little embroidered patch. Same on the other side. All these electroplated buckles. And then on the back, 
it is more Japanese text and shadow high along with this little head, which I don't, yeah, it doesn't go over the head. Uh, so this one, this jacket is longer than the shirt, so it looks, you know, aesthetically pleasing. Uh, and then, like, he has little thumb holes. That's so cute. I love it. And then his shirt is also really cute. It's this white, uh, black, and metallic silver, uh, astronaut suit, dude. With more, more Japanese lettering. It's so cool. I love him. Uh, and then he has this, like, beige gray shorts. Like, that also have, like, cargo stuff inside. These aren't cute. I'm gonna be honest, these aren't cute. <laughs> Uh, and then he also has leggings, which I know dudes try to be like, they're compression pants. Like, bitch, they're leggings. So he does have leggings. Uh, and they are, like, all decked out in, like, two layers of zippers that you just open up right there. And then you can see his knee. So th those are cool. Uh, I wouldn't have paired them with this, though. I don't know. I feel like there would have been a cuter short. Uh, and then his shoes are also really cute. They have Los Angeles, California, USA, 2022 right there. And then he has just some silver soles, or gray soles actually, not silver. There's an S on the bottom, but I don't think you can see it because it's too, too light. And then he has black laces, some gray right there, gray right there, shadow high across the top, and then two little, like, belt loop looking things in the back so yeah I do like this outfit a lot but for me I'm definitely gonna have to mix and match to get the perfect outfit so here we have him and his rainbow high counterpart river so as you can see they're pretty much the same skin tone just this one's in black and white and this one isn't uh same hairstyle too. Uh, and then he has teal on his eyes, which I guess alludes back to him. And then you see River has like ripped jeans and I like it a lot. I wish that he had black ripped jeans. That would have been game changing, but he does not. Uh, yeah. That's also a comparison with the face molds why this one's superior but I still really like this one so overall I really like him he's really cool um I just wish for the future that we get more boy dolls because you know series 4 was supposed to have one but instead we got Delilah which she's adorable so it's okay uh and then I would also like to see a different body sculpt because this is unrealistic and it bothers me uh, and lastly, I would like to see a uh, better articulation in the knees because we need that. Oh, and a new boy stand clip because this is still the same old one that River has and it's not the best at all. So that's fun. And from your reigning supreme, I grant you a wonderful, glorious, fantabulous day. Toodles.